I have to be honest with you, I'm kind of scared of this one because it's windy, wet. Ooh. I haven't ridden this one before. I already lost the road. It's very steep. I don't feel so confident about this one. I know they all look the same, but this is the mountain I can go up now. Snow is only here in one part of the trail, so it might be completely snow free for the rest of the way. So I'm gonna go as far as I can. Never done this one before either, so everything is new for me, except this slower part of the same trail. But uh, you will see. Yeah, yeah, let's go up. I'm still climbing, don't mind me. Are you kidding me? I thought this is gonna be the top, but it goes even more higher. <laughs> oh, Jesus. All right, off we go. <laughs> I wanted to do, yes, I have done it. But it fell. Anyway, I have done it. I have reached the top of 513 kilometers above the sea level. What? Meters. Meters. Whew. I have to be honest with you, I'm kind of scared of this one. I don't feel so much, <laughs> I don't feel so confident about this one. Yeah, so I'm kind of scared. If you're gonna leave a like, it will make me feel better and help me go down the trail safely. Okay, I think I'm ready. I don't know. I will probably put some nice music on top so you don't have to listen to my squeaky brakes until they warm up, you know? I already lost the road. Oh, yeah. Snake bite paradise. It's not as easy as it looks. So Hey, hey. Definitely not easy. I think my brakes are very, very hot right now. Because I can feel them becoming very spongy. I might need to stop at one point.
Oh yes. My hands got really tired already, so that's why I'm starting to go very slow and weak. Oh, Whew. I will take a small breather for my hands and my brakes. I haven't done this much of this technical stuff before. Okay, we can keep going, at least try. Had like a oh, <laughs> minute of break. Ah, oh, mud. Ah, oh, sorry. In right in the eye, like always. That was big! Brrr. In and through the forest! Yep, we don't see anything uh, around the corner. Ooh. The sound is from something stuck in my spokes. <laughs> Last time I hit that. <laughs> right there. And we are done. But you will go down this way. Not how we came up. We came up different. Oh. Okay, we're good now. Oh no. Oh.
I, I got stuck on this branch. Ah. Uh, you know the bushes? They keep catching my hands on pedals and everything. It's a bit hard to keep on the bike. Ooh. Well, I got through the top part, so I'm sure I will get through here too, you know. My hands are dead and feet too. Whew. If you want some exercise, this is the best place. Same story as with the last trail. If you want to come here for hiking or biking, you have a parking area as well, right here, next to the electricity station. Park your car, go up. This is the place. You go up either there or you go there through the gate. In the summertime, the gate is closed because they have sheep on the mountain so they don't escape but you can just open the gate close it and go up well if you live in norway you already know that but if you don't then you might not know that so here you go link is gonna be in the description like always from strava and also i guess from trail forks uh, so you can find it also what i wanted to say i'm actually really really stoked that i could do this trail i could say one of my mo that you, um, you had your most extreme trails that I have taken with all the rocks and everything and so I didn't really fall I was good on the bike so I'm really happy for myself and that I could do it but uh, now I know that I need more training on the hands because they got tired halfway <laughs> I couldn't keep keep my bike steady yeah I just wanted to share that I'm happy about this one <laughs> so it went pretty good thank you for watching subscribe leave a like and goodbye bye bye